Welcome to the Binghamton University Rover Team's System Acceptance Review for the 2023 competition year. We are excited to show our progress and innovation this year and are proud to present our 2023 rover, Generosity. Our rover's name came from an elementary student's submission through our Engineers Week rover naming contest. Our six different subteams redesigned the rover based on extensive research and lessons learned from the previous years. Our rocker bogey suspension system is made from quarter inch aluminum plate, which was topology optimized before being cut on our CNC water jet, before being welded into its final geometry. The wheels you see here are 3D printed from TPU to provide shock absorption and allow us to design custom tread patterns. These wheels are mounted to our planetary gearboxes, which provide a seven to one gear ratio. This year we implemented temperature monitoring in our gearboxes to prevent us from overloading our motors. These systems allow generosity to remain stiff and traverse with ease. The electrical team is responsible for getting power and communication throughout the rover. Our PCBs are custom made, designed by us, and then hand soldered. Each PCB is specifically designed to meet the needs of the different subteams. Utilizing the new Teensy 4.1 microcontroller platform to control individual subsystems, our electrical system can handle more complex computations and faster communication. Our custom power supply board converts power from the battery into a 5 volt. 5 amp line and a 12 volt 12 amp line for the rest of the circuitry in the rover. Our electrical system is capable of monitoring temperature of the battery as well as the voltage and current of the battery 12 volt and 5 volt lines to identify any issues. With an additional focus on safety this year, all of our boards have fuses to prevent damage in the event of motors going bad or a shortage anywhere on the rover. Our e-stop button paired with a battery fuse shuts off the rover immediately in case of problems or battery short. With brand new VESC motor controllers individually assigned to each drive motor, our rover is now easier to control and functions more fluidly while driving. The HREI team designed a six degree of freedom robotic arm capable of completing the equipment servicing and the extreme retrieval and delivery missions. This year, custom tech total gearboxes were designed under CNC, enabling a compact and refined arm. The main body of the arm was created from square aluminum extrusion, maximizing the strength and enabling easy wire routing. The end effector is connected to the arm by a generative design stainless steel 3D printed bracket and a slip ring allows for continuous 360 degree rotation. The wrist joint utilizes a worm gear and a custom housing enabling accurate positioning with minimal weight of the wrist joint. Our end effector is a parallelogram based design with an integrated hex key for turning the screw. The arm is controlled using inverse kinematics to allow for easy operator control. The environmental analysis team is tasked with correctly identifying extinct or extant traces of life based on an extreme testing plan. The team created a vacuum system for sample collection and developed a testing suite consistent of a rotating dirt carousel for efficient testing and an array of sensors for scientific examination. A microscope with a near lens LED lit barrel can detect evidence of physiochemical alterations on the rock, which are proof of growing bacteria communities. We also use peristaltic pumps and silicon tubing to direct the testing fluids into the appropriate cutouts below with a layer of acrylic and a watertight seal around our science module. This year, our software team has made massive strides from years past. Our team has two onboard computers, two Raspberry Pis running Python code. The team uses Flutter, a cross-platform app framework, to create our dashboard, giving many members the capability to run it from their computers. Flutter uses material design, which helps us create a clean, user-friendly interface. The dashboard utilizes model view view model architecture that consists of four main layers, a data layer, a layer for the hardware code, a layer for the logic model, and a layer for the UI. For autonomy, the rover determines its current GPS coordinates and compass orientation. It uses a 2D grid from a bird's eye perspective where X is measured by longitude and Y by latitude. We utilize the A-star algorithm to create a path from the current position to its goal position while taking obstacles into account. When a new obstacle is found, we rerun the algorithm to generate a new path. Together, we created a modular rover that showcases our custom manufacturing capabilities and can compete in each mission with enhanced user experience. All systems underwent and will continue to undergo strict testing to ensure all designs meet our engineering and mission requirements, followed by full system testing to ensure full functionality of our complex designs. To keep preparing for the competitions in Utah, Generosity and our operators will continue to undergo trainings to ensure each mission can be completed with ease and high precision. We are excited to compete in this year's University Rover Challenge and are proud of how far we've come. Thank you very much for your time and we can't wait to see you in Utah.